Hola hombres, me llamo Hombre Flipe And today I'm playing some Blacklight Retribution for the game of the day So this is the sequel to the game called Blacklight Tango Down uh, Which cost only about 15 bucks I think on the PSN And this game is uh, actually free to play uh, so I'm not going to talk much about gameplay, but uh, instead I wanted to talk more about the game instead. Uh, so yeah, as I said, the game is free to play, uh, but in my opinion, uh, that's not a uh, hundred percent true, because I think that uh, if you play for free, as I did, uh, you. Uh, have a very big disadvantage to others that pay because uh, you pay for guns, classes, and uh, attachment, uh, etc. So, uh, so what you do when you pay is that you buy uh, a currency called Sen, and with that you can buy, as I said, weapons and uh, such. So when you uh, only play for free, you only get to have one loadout, one class so that means that you can only stick with one gun uh, at a time which is pretty bad, I, th I think that you should at least have one class per, per gun type, you know, submachine gun, assault rifle, sniper, etc. or at least two or three uh, customable classes but yeah, anyways, um, this game is really hard to play, uh, as I said, um, because it feels like everyone else has a big uh, advantage. Maybe it's just me that sucks, but uh, yeah. So I've always been a big fan of uh, FPS games, although, <laughs> although recently uh, they just seem to make me mad. I played a couple of games of uh, Blacklight before uh, recording just to get a hang of it. <laughs> and man, I got pissed. Because, it, uh, yeah, as I said, it feels like for everyone else it takes about one shot and I'm dead. While for me, I have to shoot a whole magazine. Same thing is. No, not exactly the same thing, but uh, I also get uh, aggravated by you know Call of Duty and Battlefield because there just seems uh, be so much bullshit in these games and uh, and yeah, just annoying players. So like in the Call of Duty, uh, knifing or melee is a pretty big problem in this game because. Uh, you Sort of like commando, you just leap into uh, another player, and it yeah, it's a one. -hit. But yeah, anyways, uh, more about this game. Uh, thing that you can do is uh, while in the game, or uh, you earn battle points. I think it's called that you can purchase. Um, <coughs> oh, <laughs> sorry, um, purchase uh, armor and such during uh, throughout the, the game <coughs> for example uh, maybe you saw it earlier but uh, there was a guy fl uh, flying in a huge armor and you can also buy su things such as flamethrowers and poison I think uh, you may have seen uh, when the screen turns into other colors or just white and blue purple uh, that's a special ability that every player has that makes them able to see every player on the map for a couple of seconds uh, this can only be activated once in a while and uh, you may think it's overpowered but since you know everyone has it uh, it's not really that overpowered in my opinion, I would rather have a game, f a game that you can buy, so that everything was included, 
all the guns and such. As you see here, I pick up a minigun, which uh, is pretty awesome. I face off three guys here all by myself. Take two out, take another one out, and just cause uh, mayhem. And try to go in, but dead I. And uh, victory! So, yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. Um, I personally, I wouldn't recommend this game if you easily get, get frustrated with FPS games. Uh, yeah, try it out if you want to. I'll link the Steam store. Uh, link. <laughs> uh, yeah, as I said, thank you guys for watching. Gracias. And until next time. Adiós.